Hello, my name is Jürgen Rinelli and I'm a senior software consultant. In my today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to update an Endpoint Central on-prem version. Have fun with it! So now we are here in Endpoint Central. This is the UEMS edition and I am here on the version 2406.9 and now I'm gonna update this version to the latest version 2416.04. I have already downloaded the patch and now what's important? Very important is first of all but you have a look here at agents. Go here to the summary and have a look. Um, yeah, of course, this is a small environment. I do have only three clients. Have a look and check if all the clients are on the same version. If you do have older versions here, uh, check whether these systems are still online, still existing um, prior uh, updating. It might be possible that you lose those agents. If the version difference is too high, you might um, yeah, lose them. The, um, the agent won't be able to update automatically to the latest version. Next really, really important step to do is uh, yeah, check whether you have a snapshot from your system or um, a database backup in place in case something is going wrong. So well then that's proceed. In order to do the update we first need to stop the server. So let's go into our services and let's find manage engine UEMS server and here click on stop. In the meanwhile we can start the command prompt and here please run as administrator is really important so fine now let's find the updater update manager but this we execute and then we just wait a bit. Update manager is starting and now let's browse to our prior downloaded file. Well, let's open it and now it's going to do some um, validation checks. And we start install. This is gonna take a while. The first few minutes, I recommend you to stay with it until everything is starting because there might be some changes with what um, Manage Engine is giving a prior notice to you so um, that you won't get back after half an hour or an hour and it's still in um, progress and waiting uh, some, an, an answer from you. When it is starting backing up the significant files, this should be the time where you can leave it alone. So I'll be back when it is finished. Now we finished with the installation, with the update, and we can review the um, readme when we go on close it will open us the features, bug fixes, and enhancements, whatever has been done within the different versions. All right, when I do make a refresh here, yeah, this will happen, because I do have to start the service first. So let's start the service. So other windows, 
Now all the endpoint central modules are going to fire up. And we are able to log in again. Safety is important. And here we are. Let's have a look. Yeah, something new, got it. And let's have a look. Yeah, we are on the new version. Now, what's next? Within the agent tab, let's have a look at the summary. There, we still do have the old agent versions. This will be fixed automatically, so all the agents will get the update automatically. We just, yeah, monitor it here. So that's it for today's small tutorial about how to update Endpoint Central on-prem. Thank you for watching this tutorial. I hope you had fun and you could benefit from it. See you soon.